patient Lee Whalen Jones, aka Killer Croc. So, this is the bar for you. Try reason with me. I don't why I did it. Doc. We're here to help you, Mr. Croc. Croc, Doc. And once again, slow mo is kind of cool, but gets it, old pretty quick. Yeah, explosion effect not really all that impressive. It's nice that the door moves them around, though. I guess that's kind of cool. They're not just static uh, pieces in the environment. Ah, the snipers. Yikes! <laughs> These guys have sniper rifles. And one of them found you. Let's make this much harder. Yeah. Now, admittedly, once you uh, fly away, then they tend to lose track of you again pretty quick. Oh, Except for right there where he obviously sees you again. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going to go right over the edge. I'm not sure if that's actually programmed in here. I would love it if it was, but... But yeah, some of those guys... Actually, this right... Oh, wait, no, hold on. Look across. I guess this isn't the scenario, but... Later when you have to get up above there, mm -hmm. and there's a sniper standing right there, that's like the one of the few scenarios where the uh, remote control battering is actually useful. We'll uh, touch on it again when we get to that point in the game, I suppose. There we go. And that is how you deal with Crack! <laughs> he just did the Steven Seagal hyperextension. Alright, let's see. Where are we even headed? Over here. Now, as you can see, uh, Batman's cape is actually kind of progressively getting more and more shredded. And that'll happen as uh, the farther along in the game we go. It's an, I mean, it's a, it is scripted usually after boss fights and that kind of stuff, but it does uh, kind of give you a fun sense of Batman actually progressively taking damage over time. Nothing to see here. Just move along. Give him a little dignity. Yeah, got him down out of respect. This is the part you were talking about. Was it? This, yeah, where it's nice to have the remote control battery. Okay. Okay. Interestingly enough here, while these guys are obviously, you know, kind of one shot and then a long time before they fire again kind of guys, they're using the same rifle models as the guys with just assault rifles. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Well, I was, like, there's only two weapon models in the entire game. The, for shot the shotgun and the, and the like, G36 knockoff looking thing. But yeah, you're right. This is definitely the uh, scenario where I'm talking about where it would be nice to have the remote control battering because it allows you to, uh... I mean, I guess you can get up here just fine, but... All you really have to do is wait. There's a guard who starts off looking over in this direction, uh -huh. and if you wait for him to not be looking over here anymore, then it's okay. Yeah. But um, the battering is nice, because you can just kind of knock them on their feet, or off their feet, rather. And then run up and, and yeah, up there. It just gives you a little bit more of a time window. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, I'm actually... I'm pretty sure this is the building... Um, there's an achievement for, uh, 
uh, going like a certain distance. Oh yeah, you uh, back gliding. glide a hundred meters, and this is pretty much the only, or maybe not the only, but certainly the best place to do yeah. it. You just uh, go ahead and scan Wayne Tower while you're up here. You just jump off and just avoid buildings. Mm -hmm. You know, holding the control stick forward will keep you on the optimal angle. And that's how you get that. Bingo. Five whole gamer points for you to, uh, for you to marvel at. Marvel. TC. <laughs> I apologize for that, everyone. I mean, I mean, there's like strength, and then there's this. Th those are. It's not as ridiculous when he pulls down walls. True. I mean, th this guy is just. I'm sorry, but he's got super strength. I don't care what you say. <laughs> that sound. And as you saw very briefly there, if you knock out an enemy, uh, or knock down an enemy holding a gun, then uh, other mooks will actually go for it. They're very uh, aware of the fact that using a weapon is far more effective than your fists, and so they are kind of, you know, real interactable ob uh, objects within the game environment who enemies will take advantage of. Such a badass Batman. <laughs> there. there we go. Gotham's veins slowly filled with pain and suffering. The effects were full. <laughs> this is actually kind of uh, a. Uh, I don't know, sort of like. Uh, almost a bait and switch. There are no guys with guns in here, but they're, they're the gargoyles. And so, you really are supposed to just jump down and beat the hell out of them. Yeah, it, it takes far too long. And uh, to it do doesn't it. really matter, even if you try to, uh... Um, even if you try to, uh, do takedowns, it, there are just too many of them, and they, too, they stay too close together. Yeah. And as you can see, we're wrapping up a, you know, over 25 combo <laughs> modifier. So this is a little bit more amusing. And gives you a pretty big chunk of XP. Yeah. There are uh, achievements, I believe, for stringing up the longest combos. Uh, uh, I think there's, yeah. there's one at like 20, 20. 40, and 60. I or where don't stage? think they're, they go that high. Okay. But. Maybe it's 20, 30, and 40, I'm not sure. I think it might be 5, 10, and 20, actually. No, it's got to be more than 20, because I know there's one that I haven't gotten yet, and I've certainly gotten a times 20 uh, combo modifier. sound is very, very annoying, and it never gets any less annoying. Joker's a fan of the West Wing. Hmm. Good show. 
Now I kind of wish a character in this game was voiced by Martin Sheen. I, th I wish that about all games. True. Whatever you're doing, please stop. It makes me uncomfortable. I was going to say, it looks like those two enemies uh, took up one of the tactics that you will occasionally see uh, guards start using as time goes on. Um, the fewer they uh, there are and the more freaked out they are about what's occurring, you will occasionally see two guards actually team up and take kind of a back-to-back -back maneuver, which makes it incredibly yeah, difficult. It a go. Yeah, uh, Yeah, you really you cannot sneak up on someone who's doing that. Mm. What's going on? Like those two guys there. Yeah. One of my favorite things to do, actually, is to booby trap guys I've knocked out with the uh, explosive gel. Uh, not a bad idea. Oh, crap. No, the AI in this game is actually pretty good, all things considered. Hey, that was cool. Yeah, pulling guys off of ledges is uh, actually an auto kill. Really? Well, not a kill, but yeah, it'll knock them out every time. That's interesting, I didn't know that. <laughs> like I said, the AI is mostly good, all things considered. <laughs> there are times where you just take out his buddy directly behind him, and he won't seem to notice. need help. What's so important about the notes? Joker wants them. That makes them important. Stay here. I'm going to find her. Ah, the childish antics of Joker and Batman. Why do you even care? Joker wants them! That means I want them! 